show you what it looks like at night here. There we go, it's all lit up. Looks really nice. Zoom out. Super zoom in. Start over here with Ikea's and Arena. I'll just pan across. Yeah, it's really nice. Alright guys, I'm going to bed now. See you tomorrow. Peace. Alright guys, so we're trying to go out this morning, go get something to eat. It's a nice day today. It's about, I don't know, around 80 something degrees right now. So yeah. Oh, there was something that I, I wanted to bring up. There's um, about bringing your, like, your electronics over here. There's two types of plugs over here. You see that one there? It's very common. And then there's another one. It's like this. Plug like that. So when you bring like your clippers or hair dryers over here, I'm gonna tell you the best solution for that. If you know you're gonna be traveling to where there's um, the country, the, it's like 220 power rating. You can either buy something like this, which is a power converter has these different attachments. I got this off of Amazon. It's a power converter, just the, the power button right here. And it has, this one has a USBs, ports on it. You can plug your cell phone and stuff up in that. Um, and, oh, let me get this right here. I need to show you this charger. Let me grab this one here. This one and iPhone, iPhone block, these two. So these two right here, if you bring your cell phones over here, make sure you bring bringing the original chargers for that phone. Don't go to like Walmart or something and get those really cheap charging blocks. The block is the, is the main important thing for your phone. So Apple, make sure you get using the original because these are actually converters. You don't have to buy this. You can go to any country and plug this in as long as you have the double prong plug that will fit in there. Um, you can use this anywhere, okay? And it's got small writing on there. I, I can't see this one, but I'm pretty sure it says like travel, um, travel charging. This one right here, this is like for a Samsung or something like this, a lightning charging port. And um, this is also a traveling charger, okay? You have to, if you can't see this, take a picture with your phone and then blow it up and read it. It's, it's, it's for traveling, okay? So you don't have to buy a converter to plug this in to charge your phone. You can use this anywhere, even if it's 220. And the United States, you know, we're like 110. You can take this anywhere and plug it up and it's going to convert the power and not destroy your phone. Now bringing like clippers, bringing hair clippers, like I brought this because um, I don't have that much hair. I don't need to go to a barbershop because I, I can do this myself. But these are liners. This is probably one of the best liners here that I've used. This is from the United States, okay? And the plug is here, like that. And you can bring your clippers now this is what I did a couple years ago I just since I'm coming here a lot I just went on and bought, bought clippers from here okay I'm going to go buy some liners that are for here then that way and this is the same way with your hair dryers because some hair dryers especially like my wife she has a Dyson you can't plug it up in a converter and use it because it may destroy it even though it's trying to convert the power. 
your best solution for electronics and if you're going to keep traveling here just go to a shop here and buy the clippers the blow dryers the curling irons from the philippines keep them take them back home to the u.s and then when you travel again you can bring those things back and use that you don't have to keep uh keep bringing this converter because it doesn't make sense it makes sense but it doesn't make sense especially if you keep traveling to those places that have uh, 220 uh, power and just you buy the equipment there buy the electronics there that you're going to use you can if you have family members here just package it up and leave it with the family member and when you travel back you can get those things and use it so very important to, to get clippers um curling irons blow dryers all that stuff just and that's about it I just wanted to make a quick video on that but we're about to go out and um, enjoy anything if I miss anything just leave a comment and I don't know over here so yeah we're still in the same spot right now we're about to get out of here we're gonna go get something to eat and we're gonna go to our next destination which is very very beautiful all right guys see you in the next one peace